What's going on guys, Vacant Paradise back and welcome to another Charizard hunt video. We're not doing so hot. If you've been following it, don't forget to subscribe and press the notification bell to stay up to date on the Charizard hunt. I had so many burning shadows packs in so many things that I had laying around. I just wanted to again look for that card. Because I will say this one more time. I'll probably say it another time after this. But, you know, I got it very early when the set came out. And I get lots of love and lots of hate on my Charizard video. And I want to know, just by doing a legitimate search, how difficult is it in fact to find Charizard? I myself could not tell you because I got it so early in the release of the set. Lots of people comment about how bigger, more popular YouTube people have such a hard time finding this card and they do series like this where they look for this card and it doesn't come and I want to know if I'll just be another statistic, which I will be, apparently. I don't know. Anything can happen. <laughs> of course, I'm referring to pulling the Rainbow Rare Charizard out of one of these packs. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Saturday... We have 12 packs of Burning Shadows and, of course, our 5-pack Friday, Burning Shadows. So there's our first pack. You know what? No reason to do do that. There is an Alolan Raticate in there. There, there, is no, there is no reason to pack trick something like that. Next we get Necrozma. Because some of them are backwards, some of them are not. It confuses me. I don't know if it means something or if it's like whatever it's from. Because I, you know, I mixed them all up. I don't know which one was from the boxes. I don't know which one was from the booster boxes. I don't know which ones were from the blister packs. So I don't know what which one means. Curlia, Weavile, Reverse, and a Zygarde Hollow. Which is not so bad. Because we're not hitting a decent amount of hollows. We're not really hitting a, de hitting a decent amount of, of reverse rares. And we are not hitting a decent amount of ultra rares whatsoever. Though I do know that because the booster box. That there is at least one full art. And then there is at least one secret rare. And there is at least one something else. My brain... Sometimes it shuts down in the middle of my thoughts. So there's at least one secret, one full art, and one trainer. One full art trainer, I want to say. Although, I don't believe that any of those are guaranteed out of a box either. So our next pack is another Ho-Oh pack. Here's a code card. We have an Alolan Rotata, a Porygon, Panpor, Pan Sage, Asper, Seedra, Lunatone, Rhydon, Kingdra, Reverse, and there's something shiny behind this guy. Please be more than a regular old Ultra Rare. Necrozma GX. It isn't, but that's fine. It is super okay with me. All right, moving on. We got Tapu Fini on this pack. This code. Celebratory style. And just in case you didn't see the peak, it was a white code. All right. Stuffle. Right after a Darkness Energy and a Mudbray and a Tynamo and an Oddish and a Duskull, and a Buffalant, and a Charmeleon, Rhydon, Crabominable, Reverse Rare, and a Lucario Hollow. I thought we were going to hit another, but I guess not. Next pack has Necrozma on the front. There is yet another code. Energy. Man. And we've got ourselves a Sandy Gast. 
Venipede, Horsey, Mudbray, Ladaba. There's an electric Wubbuffet, Whirlipede, Simi Seer, Reverse, Uncommon, and a Turtonator. Simi Seer, Reverse Rare. It rhymes. That's what I wanted, but it wasn't that. So, next pack of Burning Shadows. As all the horses above me decided to start slamming their feet around. Something that happens very, very, very often around here. I absolutely hate it. Magikarp, Krogunk, Pikachu, we got a Panseer, Charmander, Porygon 2, a Kiawe, and Olivia, Mount Lanakilla, and a Beware. All right, I believe we are about halfway through, a little more than halfway through this pile. Of course, tomorrow will be Five Pack Friday. Also, Burning Shadows. You guys can go ahead and get in on some of this code card action. If you get one, let me know in the comments. I always appreciate hearing back. Got a Noibat, Plumeria, Soul Rock, another Gushma, and we got a Panthere and a Raquinid. Woohoo! Four packs left. There we go. There is a code. Figure it out. <laughs> Good luck to you guys. And of course, whatever you get out of your packs, just let me know in the comments down below because maybe you were looking for something that you wanted to play with. You got a Stuffle, Crab Roller, Morlul, and Electabuzz, Alana, Metapod, Sophocles, Reverse Rare, and the rare is... Noivern GX Full Art. There we go. That's what we want to start seeing that is what we want to start seeing. All right, next pack is, of course, Necrozma on the front. Here is a celebratory code card for you guys. All right, and we got ourselves Cutie Fly, Dew Fighter, Toki Demaru. We have a Wimpod. Meowth, Civ Viper, Super Scoop Up, Sammy Poor, Dark Rye, Reverse Rare, and Crabominable. Two packs to go. Oh yeah, I tried to be all super slick with that one. Didn't work. Slow and Steady always wins that race. Next pack is Pikachu, Pan Seer, we have a Charmander, and a Lolan Rattata, Porygon, Poe Town, Rotom Dex, Sammy Poor, an NK Reverse, and a Golisopod GX. Awesome. Of course, I got a bunch of these packs out of the Team Skull pin collection, which were as part of the Game Stuff clearance sale picked up I believe six of those boxes so 12 of these packs or one whole stack of mine did in fact come from those boxes and this is the final pack celebratory code guard you know I keep forgetting full art guzma exists but does it exist in this set is my question I'm assuming yes we have a Tangela, Rhyhorn, Riolu, Cutie Fly, Tynamo, Sophocles, An Escape Rope, a Rotomnex, Meryl, Reverse Common, and the final card is Shenotic. Just Shenotic. As I drop everything. That's right. You up there, walk back in the other direction. 
or, or keep marching around. I don't know. I don't know what you're doing, but you're bothering me. You're distracting me from doing what I love to do. And that is create some videos for you guys. We got two ultra rares this time. We got Necrozma GX and we got Glissopod GX. Two very, very solid cards as well as a full art Neuvern GX. Very, very cool. This, I think, has been the best part of the whole thing. So go ahead, do yourself a favor, and go back and watch the other parts of this series. Don't forget to subscribe. Check out all the links in the description of this video and every video. And thank you guys for watching. I am Vacant Paradise. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Comment down below. Let me know what your favorite card was. Leave a like if you liked it. Leave a dislike if you disliked it. Share this video with your friends. Follow me on Twitter at VacantPokemon, and I will see you guys in my next video.